Mila and Lena's way. Hey y'all, what's up? It is me, Lena. Guys, don't forget to like this video, share this video, comment on this video, and what? Subscribe to this YouTube channel. I almost forgot. And don't forget to follow me on social media. It's gonna be up at the top. And don't forget to go check out our other videos, guys. Cause we have a whole bunch of videos. I'm trying to get these videos out and quick. So this is a late review. I'm sorry, but this is a new show on ABC that aired Tuesday night, October 3rd. Guys, this show is called Kevin Probably Saves the World. Not saving the world, but he probably saves the world. And I actually like it. Um, the, the, it got premiered, it was 4.17 million viewers, I don't really know if that's a lot or not, but it seems sounds like a lot to me, but it actually premiered, and I was like, it actually premiered, I don't make sense, it premiered, and I watched it, and you know, I was like, mm, am I gonna watch it, because normally I don't watch shows that's kind of like this, like, this kind of remind me of The Good Place on NBC, but not a lot, but kind of a little bit, so normally I don't really watch sitcoms that's like light like this, but I actually was really interested in this show, so it stars Jason Ritter, guys. Kevin, he played Kevin. I don't know if y'all know, but y'all might know Jason Ritter. What is this? Jason Ritter was on a ton of stuff, um, but I don't know if y'all ever recognize his voice, but he did voice Dipper Pines on Gravity Falls, guys. Gravity Falls is amazing, but he was Dipper on there. But Jason Ritter, he plays the lead character, Kevin Finn. His sister is Amy Cabrera. Joanna Garcia Swisher play her. Guys, Joanna was on Reba, and she played Cheyenne, and I loved her. Reba so much like I love like I watched all all of the Reba episodes I am pretty sure I watched all the Reba episodes so I was like wait a minute at first I was like because she kind of resembled Amy Adams and Eyes of Fish and I was like wait is that her and I was like wait no and I saw her name I was like oh my god that's Cheyenne from Reba I'm, I'm, I love Reba so much it also starred Kimberly Her Herbert Gregory as Yvette India de Beaufort as Kristen Allen, J. August Richards as Deputy Nathan Purcell, Chloe East as Reese Carrera, Amy's daughter and Kevin's niece, Dustin Yabar as Tyler Medina. So, guys, on this show, you got Kevin. He is going to live with his sister, Amy, and his niece, Reese, for a little bit. He said a little bit. He tried to commit suicide. He lost his job. He lost his girlfriend. He was a big stock investor in New York, but he lost his job. So, you know, he got really depressed, tried to commit suicide. So, Amy was really hurt by that because her husband had just passed away, who was Reese's dad, and they really had a hard time dealing with it. She's a mechanical engineer. Like, she deal with a lot of stuff like NASA and the FBI, we call her stuff, the government. So that's her job. But Reese, she's having a really hard time. She's not really opening up. She used to play soccer, but she don't play soccer no more because soccer and her soccer was hers and her dad thing. Like they would go and get ice cream after because he's like, how many change? How much change can you find in the car? Go get ice cream. And she would always specifically put that much change in there so she can just go and get it. But he never said anything about it. Sneaky kid. But um, that's what she was like. They having a hard time with it. So Amy was like, look. If you're just going to act erratic, because, you know, he was acting erratic all throughout the episode because a meteor had hit. He took the kid while Amy was gone to go look at the meteor. He touched the meteor. He passed out. He got shocked. The meteor was in the car. Reese was like, why would you put the meteor in the car? And he's like, I don't even remember putting the meteor in the car. So come to find out, when he went back out to the car, Yvette was the freaking meteor. So Yvette was is a messenger like sent from god what she said a warrior sent from god multiple people of righteousness and he's like the last righteousness that they have and he has to go and you know just spread joy spread love and you know fulfill himself because he always said did he she asked him did you ever feel fulfilled in your life or did you have anything that you know your purpose like, what was your purpose you know this this can be your purpose so he was like i don't think it's my purpose but he realized that it kind of was because out of nowhere, he would just be showing kindness and love. And he really didn't like it because he's pretty selfish. But, yeah. He was like, I'm just going to show kindness and love. And when that happened, he was like, oh, my God, what's going on with me? So, Yvette was like, oh, my God, it's the next step. She made him get rid of his car. He went and met up with um, Kirsten, the, the te Reese's teacher, which was his old classmate, which was, like, his old ex-girlfriend. So, she was like, mm, so they probably going to get back together. But the main thing of the show is Kevin is now, like, a messenger. And he's like gonna be spreading love and spreading joy not being selfish no more just when somebody need to hug give him a hug it was like when he was at the airport about to leave he was like he was about to talk to this guy he was like man all this stuff happened to me i tried to commit suicide this and that he just went on and on and he come to find out the guy was deaf so he's like oh okay but then he's like fine then he left but then the guy gave him his pencil and he's like well i'll buy you your pen your pencil from you so then kevin gave him a whole lot of money so the guy just hugged him and then everything just like glued and then butterflies started coming out of his closet. It was a lot of stuff that was different signs. And he felt that. He's like, oh my god, I felt it. You know, maybe I'm... He thought he was done. He's like, no, you're not done. This is what you're getting feel. You know, you're going to feel that when you're doing good. So, Reese is supposed to be like his 
Reese is his niece, but he's supposed to be there also to help her too because he is helping her. Because, oh my god, nobody else can see the event. So when he's talking, he's just talking like out loud, like talking, and he forget he's talking out loud to nothing. So that she's like, hmm, maybe Uncle Kevin is crazy, but somehow he's helping and he fit in here. So they just gonna think he's crazy. Amy thought he was crazy, but then she was like, okay, you can say. So I mean, it's like the way it happened. It's like it's let's like, see, like he's crazy, but really he's doing like a good thing and he's like a really good person. So well, now he is, you know, because he got freaking strike by the mirror because before he was kind of a little kind of selfish they said but now this is gonna be his purpose and i really do like this show it's lighthearted. it's it's like different it gives me like the, the feeling of the good place but not the good place because the good place is different than this but it just gives me that same feeling like it's in the same genre but i do like it and i do think it is really good um i can't wait to see next week and see how the storyline goes like who help who who helps I'm trying to see if I'm going to watch it next week. I will watch it next week, and I'm going to try to watch the next episodes. But I think it's a nice show, and I think you guys should watch it just like to see if you like it and stuff. Because I do like it's like heart lighthearted. I was like, wow, okay, you really got me there. Like I was like, hmm. Like normally I tune out of shows, but I was like in tune with this, and I was actually watching it. So it must be good. But guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Don't forget to check Kevin Probably Saves World on ABC. And um, yeah, go forget to check out other videos. We got Star. Empire that'll be up and the mayor which was a new ABC show that start from start that premiered on the same night so um yeah guys don't follow me on social media and shout out to the cast but it's a great premiere and um yeah bye